waka 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 Hello my loves, I'm Miss Man Man. Welcome to my channel. I am traveling, so this is my filming setup. And I want to start by saying, I am so sorry from the noise coming from this. They start at seven and don't stop until about 5.30. All day, every day. I will do my best with the sound, but there will be all sorts of noises coming from the background. My apologies. I am always trying to be on the hunt for weird and wonderful vintage products and seeing how they work by today's standards in my little series, Testing Vintage. And I recently stumbled upon this. This is a hair grip or a ring comb and it was released by Kin Hip Metal and Plastic Factory. I really want to put the S in plastics so it makes sense but mm -hmm. what this little comb claims to do is to create wonderful and exciting hairstyles and I wanted to see if I can get two of them to work so in today's episode of testing vintage we will be checking out the hair grip I was very excited to find this product I found it on Etsy for only a couple of dollars and the fact that it still came on its little advertisement booklet was very exciting. It is attached, so I'm going to go and get some scissors and we will figure it out. It always feels really scary to cut a vintage product. Oh, you're not even, gonna, oh, your wire, not plastic. You said plastic. Oh, you also say metal. Okay, fine. Oh. This is our ring comb. So we've got multiple teeth in the middle. We've got a little hinge on one side and then a little lightning clasp, which just clicks. Lovely. I popped my hair in curlers, haven't taken them out. And we are going to test out two styles. The first being the instructions on my booklet, which is for a front wave. Uh. And the second, which is actually the most popular way to use a ring comb, is to create a ponytail. Oh no, I sprayed setting spray on my roots, so it's gonna get all claggy. I'm not gonna play with my hair too much because I wanna keep it bouncy. I'm not a hairstylist. I can never master my own hair. Never have, probably never will. It does what it wants. I am just having to deal with it daily, but this is the look we are going for. And the instructions are as follows. Comb hair from part line as desired. Insert either half of hair grip through the hair, pressing the rim of the comb as shown in the picture. Snap hair grip shut and finish your hair arrangement around it. Right, so we've got this. We're gonna open the comb and we're just gonna put one half in and then click. <gasps> okay. I, I mean, it's in there. Thanks, I hate it. But like, why though? I don't... I don't see it adding any value to the hairstyle. Let's, um, I kind of hate it. Okay. Let's see what we can do with this. I know there's a learning curve to a lot of products in general, especially when it comes to styling. Oh, but what do I do with, do it, does it just, and then to the back? Maybe, do I need more volume? Because so far, I'm still not leaving the house like this. What if, what if we just, Droop it, but it just looks point like it's just a ring. You know when you put in a really pretty comb or a couple of hair barrettes and it's there, and it's beautiful, it's decoration? No. 
and finish your hair arrangement around it. Honey, I can't even arrange to have breakfast on time. What makes you think I'm gonna arrange my hair? I don't think this comb is necessary to be there. But I'm gonna say that's the first look. Let's move on to look two, which is just a ponytail. Why am I worried I'm gonna break it when it grips my hair? Okay, the hair is pulled back. I'm going to get the hair grip behind. And then click. Okay, that's not too bad. I don't have enough hair for this size. I mean, I'm not mad at it. These hair grips come in multiple sizes. And I think that will really affect the way it holds your hair up. I clearly thought I had enough hair to fill this, but I don't. I probably would have gone down a size or two smaller and that would have gripped all my hair. I am not mad at this ponytail. It is not the smoothest and I'm not getting a lot of lift and volume, but I also don't feel any pinching. It doesn't really feel heavy. I kind of just want to quick fire out some other ideas. Bear with me. If I roll and wrap that, but then put this in as just a comb. No. But do you see what I'm trying to do? No. If I bury this in the back, as a comb and then like pin that up. What do you think? I can see why you're not popular today. I have a theory. <laughs> this would be good. If you have short hair, mine is getting quite long. I'm actually growing it out. And you didn't put product all over your roots, which is weighing everything down. And you had quite a beautiful, rich curl. Like I'm thinking like 1940s fluffy curls. I think you could do a really nice side sweep because it'll just, you'll have that fluff and you can use it as a comb. I can't, my hair is too slippery. There's too much product in it. The curls didn't really set. So it's not working for me. But there's got to be ways of wearing it. If I just sneak up on it. Okay, so a thing is happening. What do you think? Oh. Cute. Sad. Cute. Sad. Tell me your secrets. How are you pinning it from here? Like, why would you pin it? there maybe and then everything else is up i think i'm going to call it quits there let's pop her back into a ponytail because that's the only thing we got working today if my curls were curling We could use that as the basis of a poodle. Oh, hold on guys, hold on. Yeah, I, I, would, I would wear that out. We got some cute curls at the front. I think we got two out of three hairstyles. This counts as one. This is the desperate poodle. We got a ponytail and the fun, fancy, frou-frou thing is just, no, no. But I'm gonna call it there. I'm gonna go enjoy the 12 minutes of sunshine I have left before the rain comes again. Thank you so much for joining me and putting up with ridiculous conditions. You good? 
I will be back next week with a brand new video. But until then, be kind, be true, be you. Please feel free to like, comment and subscribe as well as find me on any of my social media. I'd love to get in touch with you all and get to know you all a little bit better. <sighs> Have a beautiful week, guys. Bye. I'm not mad at this little updo though. I'm going to keep that for the rest of the day. The Kin Hip Metal and fab Fabric. See, I want to go fabric shopping. That's really what I want to do. Oh, that's really satisfying. <laughs> right. I'm going to do this with a mirror. Balance on top of a water bottle. Because this is professional. Yes, I always have a Disney teacup somewhere in my vicinity, no matter where I am in the world.